Sure. Uh, I used to be a, I used to run an IT department for uh, a small business and a few small businesses with on-premise exchange service. So uh, it really piqued my interest when this vulnerability came up, but uh, I don't, I don't really know a lot about it. Do you think you could just give us a bit of an overview of the situation and what's happened? I can give you a, an overview as far as the specifics, the articles at the bottom of my experts exchange article, they're growing all the time as far as the number of links and that there's, there's four folks out there who are far more knowledgeable about the specific details of, uh, of the vulnerability, but in exchange 13, 16 and 19, we have a series of four vulnerabilities that folks can take advantage of one step, two step, three step, four step to from outside access to system. So basically running as system, which you know what that means. Mm -hmm. One of the first things that seems to be done is the LSAS service gets dumped, which means any passwords that may be sitting in memory are now out there, which could be your system, system uh, services on the exchange server itself, or, or if you've got an exchange admin, that kind of thing that's logged in recently. So that immediately places the, the need to reset all passwords across the board and, and more. Mm 